Hello YouTube, Rob Wall back again with a quick video. Are we being led down by the garden path? That is the question. Have a look at this from uh, GBN Live. See what you think about this. Monologue. It had been up to like, I think, three million views in nothing flat, quite incredible. And Neil, it was uh, a, a great monologue because it, it was a kind of a, an Occam's razor thing that the most obvious explanation for the way every, for why everything has been screwed is because our rulers want it to be so. 100% that is the conclusion that I'm, that I'm coming to. I think it's been too painful. People have quite understandably, myself included, spent the longest time tying ourselves in knots, mm. trying to make it make sense uh, in terms of an understanding of a, of a benevolent, benign authority that, whether it was Tory or Conservative or Liberal, had your best interests at heart. And it dawned on me at some point in the, in the recent past that actually the easier explanation was to say, well, no, they no longer have our best interests at heart. And once those scales drop from your eyes, then so much of it becomes much more comprehensible and, mm. it, and you begin to see it for what it is, which is wholesale, a wholesale push by the state to take total control of our lives, our money, our diet and, and everything else. Well, it, it is uh, weird the way they're quite open about wanting us to lead poorer, meaner, ruder, lives uh, just in terms of how we live what we eat where we go they, they actually say no 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 however good it was for you 20 years ago 30 years ago it's going to be worse for your kids now i think that's indicative of what i think is a, a massive mistake that's being made by them that i think they think it's all in place now that the <laughs> Mm. <laughs> the trap has all mm. been assembled and we're in it. Mm. Uh, and I, I, I think they've gone off half-cocked. Mm. And, and I think they're wrong in that estimation. And I think, in, in reality, I think a lot of their narrative is, is crumbling like, you know, desiccating sand in a sandcastle mm. on the beach. And, it, and it's about to fall apart completely, I think. So uh, there's, a, there's a terrible misconception, I think, on the part of those who think they have us in their, in their clutches. Mm. But I think, I think what we're looking at is... is uh, I mean, there's, there's always been unholy alliances between businesses and corporations mm. and government, you know, for each other's m mutual back scratching. But I think we're seeing a particularly lethal iteration at the moment because the, the added twist is that now governments are prepared to legislate to make the consumption of or the submission to the mission statements and the products of corporations. They're, they're now making it almost mandatory. I mean, what a brilliant business plan, for example, for a pharmaceutical company, hypothetically, to come up with a new medical product right. and then have a, a compliant uh, government make it illegal to not take it. Yeah. Like, ka-ching, ka-ching. Yeah. From, on the, yeah. And likewise, if you say to people, if you've got a corporation who, for its own reasons, wants to change the way we eat, mm. that whole philosophy uh, wants to come up with plant-based or, or fake meat or, or highly processed product of one sort or another for which they hold the patent, mm. If you've got a biddable government that will make it illegal to keep cattle, that will make it illegal to grow wheat and barley because they've taken the land away from the farmers, then again, you know, the, the tills are going to ring loud because people are left with no option. And something similar is happening with, with the climate crisis in inverted commas. You know, where uh, it's now there are, uh, building wind turbines, you know, laying out fields of solar panels, switching people to electric cars taking away gas boilers, replacing them with heat pumps. People were, were losing choice. We're even losing the right to refuse. Yeah. It's becoming... It, the governments are legislating against us so that we can't even say, no, no, I, I actually prefer the old way. I'll stick with that. Thank you very much. I'll keep some folding yeah. paper money in my pocket and yeah. I'll have, a, and I'll have a, a gas boiler. Thank you very much. Yeah. But that option has been taken away. So, as I say, I think we're now seeing an iteration of an old problem uh, which sees a, a you know a, a, a perfect iteration of a of a business model that for for governments and corporations working in concert is a beauty. Well, it 